Yo, what's good guys and welcome back to the Xetro Beast TV. Today I'm about to show you something different and a bit revolutionary in my opinion. Imagine that while you're making a beat, there is a musician seated near you that can play whatever instruments you need for it. And first of all, that can fit exactly what you need. Well, using AI Studio by Moises, this is actually possible. With this new tool that is currently in beta version, but it's getting consistently upgrades and improved you can start from a single idea and generate new stamps that fits the vibe you're working on. Because AI Studio is context aware. That means it takes notes about what you're creating and it provides you new stamps that fits the context you created in the beginning. So let's see it in action. AI Studio is basically like a DAW, you can import stuff, you can record instruments directly inside it, cut and move the clips to create an arrangement, and you have control on any instrument, changing the volume, you can change the pan. So I just imported this piano loop that sounds like this. So I created just a chord progression with some top notes so AI Studio can provide me better ideas. So once we imported our loop and set it also the right BPM and key, we can go here in this AI section and uh, open this stem generation. In this new window, we are about to choose the instrument and the genre that uh, we want for our new stem. We can choose from drums, bass, guitar, and also there is this uh, section called Others, where we have violin, strings, lo-fi keys, and also electric piano. I think we can start with the bass line. We can choose from this genre. We have like punk, trap, hip hop, uh, funk, I mean, we have whatever. Or you can go with custom and describe with a prompt basically the sound that you need. But in this case, I want to go with a preset. Another thing we can select is AI Match, where basically AI Studio analyzes your initial idea and trying to create a based on context audio on that. But if you select the genre, it's better to have like a more accurate idea, you know what I'm saying? Hey, this ain't a bad bass line. Let's add some other instruments. And now that we have two tracks in the project, AI Studio will consider both. Or if we want that uh, it considers just one element, we can just, for example, move the bass. So AI Studio will create a new stem considering just the piano loop. That's what I'm about to do because I want that the violin follows like the piano. So I move the bass and I generate a new stem. This sounds actually like an ensemble, bro, like crazy. But let's add some more. I want a guitar now. Some electric maybe, but I see that I have also acoustic finger picking that might sound good. Let's go with acoustic finger picking. I'm curious. Let's keep in consideration everything for this one and let's generate. Hey, this is fire, bro. This is fire. Can we add also an electric one to give some more like power? Let's go with the guitar solo. It 
It's like I have some kind of orchestra in front of me and I'm telling, yo, play this for me. Yo, play this for me. <laughs> I mean, this is crazy. I think we can just add some drums to have some more context and maybe like to use it as intro of our hypothetic beat. So I go with hip hop and let's see what it generates. Fire! You can pan everything a little bit to the left and to the right. And with AI Studio, you can't just generate stems, but you can also do the stem separation. So if you want like to extract, for example, the vocals from a track or just a, an instrument, a guitar or whatever, you can separate every stem of the track. This is a really, really helpful feature. Also, if you do some kind of remix or something, you will can also use this feature called AI voice conversion that basically will transform your recorded vocals into over 50 studio quality AI voice models. AI Studio can also detect the chords of your melody. Just click here on the three dots and then let the AI detect the chords. So now you have all the chords written on top here. And if there's something wrong, you can double click the chord and basically manually change it from this window. And the last AI thing you can do is the AI mixing. So let's try it for this one. So we let AI Studio analyze our track. And here we have even more control on every instrument because we can like choose the kind of presence we want for the instrument. If we want it in the background or normal or lead. We can pan the instrument to the left or the right. We can add reverb. So let's try to add some reverb on the electric guitar, some reverb to the acoustic guitar and uh, some reverb also on the strings. Once you're done with your stem generating and mixing, you can decide to export your full mix or you can also export the mix plus the stems. So if you want to finish your project in the dough you usually use, you can export every stem and uh, finish your project and add your final touches in the other dough. AI Studio is available on the web and desktop apps and there is also a mobile version of it. So you can use it on your phone. You can use it for free and if you finish your generative credits, you can switch to a premium or pro plan to have more monthly credits and also to unlock some other features and also no worries about copyright because you own every piece of music you generate with ai studio let me know what you think about this ai tool in my opinion it's super helpful when you need something specific for your project and you don't want to waste a lot of time searching for the right sample. And most important thing, you can get something unique that has never been used. If you want to try it as well, I'll leave you the link in the description. Like always, don't forget to subscribe to the channel and see you in the next video, guys.